Hey everybody, what's going on? I wanted to make a quick video to tell you how to play Infinite Magic Raid on your PC. One of the more common questions I get as a mobile game creator is, how are you playing this on your PC? And the answer for me is always BlueStacks. I have been using BlueStacks for a long time. I've been working with them for a while now. And I, I want to give a big shout out to them for sponsoring this video today. There's going to be a link below for you to download Infinite Magic Raid uh, through BlueStacks on your PC if you want to play. You'll support the channel a, a little bit and be able to play on your computer. And BlueStacks has a lot of really cool features, too. The, I think the one I get the most out of, honestly, is the multi-instance. You can load multiple instances. So, so I have more than one Infinite Magic Raid account, for example. So this is my free-to-play. But in another window here, I've got my main account going. So I've just got both of these windows going uh, all day long. <laughs> both accounts are just grinding all day long. Uh, you can control your FPS. You can switch over into Eco Mode right here if you're running multiple instances and you want to do it more efficiently. I honestly never use it, and I don't have any problems. Uh, but I'll be honest with you, BlueStacks used to have a lot of issues. It used to lag real bad. It used to be real slow. And then they dropped this BlueStacks 5 update, and it's just been killer. Um, so I, I've, I've started working with them again, actually, since the update has, has dropped. It's, it's been very solid. I run two or three instances all day, most days, and I never have any problems with it anymore. It runs very smooth. And again, it makes my life a lot easier to not have to figure out how to screen mirror and do all this other stuff. I just I just run BlueStacks. So a lot of really cool features. You can set macros. You can do all kinds of things through BlueStacks. I'm not going to go over all of that in this video. If you guys want to learn how to do some of that, we can do a follow-up video, and I'll, I'll show you how to you know, set up some macros to do some things for you and some of the other cool stuff it can do. But the point of this one was just to show you how you can play the game on your PC. So uh, again, there's a link below if you want to click that link and support the channel a little bit and be able to play on your PC. That is how I do it. That is the way I recommend to do it. And that'll be that. So if you have any questions, feel free to holler at me. Otherwise, I'm going to get out of here. Appreciate y'all. Hope you have a good one. Later.